Hello YouTubers, DIY Dan here bringing you another DIY video. Recently my MacBook Pro started acting up, so instead of trying to fumble around with fixing it, I decided it was time to start fresh. In this video, I will show you what steps I took in order to erase the hard drive and reinstall the operating system. So let's go ahead and get started. The first thing you want to do is back up any important data off of your hard drive. Since the hard drive is getting erased, any data that is stored on it will be lost. There are a couple of ways you can back up data from your computer. You can use a USB hard drive, USB thumb drive, or Apple iCloud service. Apple does provide you with 5 gigabytes of free space on their iCloud service, so I recommend you take advantage of that. In this step, I will show you how to back up data using a USB drive and Apple iCloud. This will give you two options in case one of the other options does not work for you. First, let me show you how to back up data using a thumb drive. Plug in your thumb drive into your computer's USB port. Once the computer has recognized the thumb drive, a new icon will appear on the desktop. In my example, the thumb drive has been recognized as thumb drive. Next, I'm clicking on the thumb drive icon to open it, and then creating a folder called backup. I'll copy any data from my computer's hard drive into this folder. Now it's just a matter of going to the location of where the files are located on my hard drive and copying them over to the backup folder I created. In this example, I'm copying files from the downloads folder and putting them in the backup folder on my USB thumb drive. To copy files from your hard drive to Apple iCloud, it's almost the same process. You want to create a folder within iCloud where you'll store your files. Here, I'm creating a new folder called Backup in iCloud. Simply select the files you want to backup and copy them to your iCloud folder. So now, any files I want to save from my computer's hard drive will be stored in this backup folder in iCloud. Any files that were copied by using one of these two methods will be waiting for us after we are done reinstalling the operating system. Now that we are done backing up any important data, we are now ready to put the computer into recovery mode. Recovery mode contains the utilities that are needed in order to erase the hard drive and reinstall the operating system. In order to get the computer into recovery mode, we have to shut down the computer. Once the computer is shut down, hold the Command plus R keys and hit the power button. Once the computer is done booting into recovery mode, you should see a menu that looks like this. Click on Disk Utility. Now select your hard drive. Mine is labeled as Macintosh HD. Once you have your hard drive selected, click Erase. Once the hard drive has been erased, we are now ready to reinstall the operating system. To get back to the main menu, click the red X in the upper left hand corner. Now click on Reinstall OS X and follow the on-screen instructions. Click Continue here to start the installation of the operating system. Next, accept the software license agreement. To begin the installation of the operating system, you need to select a destination drive to store the files to. In my case, this is Macintosh HD. In this step, I select the Macintosh HD icon by clicking on it, and then click Install to begin the installation. Next, a login prompt will pop up. Enter in your Apple ID and password. Once your Apple ID and password have been verified, the download will begin. Once the files have been installed, we are now ready to set up the computer. First, select your country and keyboard layout. Next, set up your internet connection. Here, you have the option to restore your data from a time machine. Since I backed up my data using iCloud and a USB drive, I will select Don't Transfer Any Information Now and click Continue. Enter in your Apple ID and password and click Continue. Next, agree to the terms and conditions. Now that the terms and conditions have been accepted, you'll begin the basic setup of the computer like user accounts, file vault options, etc. Continue following the on-screen instructions until the setup is complete. Congratulations! You just successfully erased the hard drive and reinstalled the operating system on your Mac computer. Now it's just a matter of restoring the files we saved from iCloud and our USB thumb drive and putting them back on our hard drive. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments section and I'll do my best to answer them. If you thought this video was helpful, please hit the like button. Good luck! 